All right. Um, sometimes the best debates we always joke happen in the green room or during a break. Uh, Hydrofracking. You, uh, I, I know you got your own. You got your hard hat ready. Oh, man. Start drilling That's the the to do. <laughs> Hey, listen, when we're talking about creating jobs in New York, uh, as fracking has created jobs in Pennsylvania, just our neighbors, that is a real solution versus what Andrew Cuomo has proposed, which is casinos. That's not a real solution towards jobs. I mean, fracking will create at least 50,000 jobs in the state that, that, that we need. And so this, and, and the governor has held up this fracking report for all we all agree term. that the governor has ducked this thing, but you feel comfortable that you you know enough that well, about what's in the stuff that they're pumping in there and that it's safe. I, I feel like it's, we haven't had any major fracking incidents all in right. this country. There right? are towns, there are towns in Pennsylvania and Ohio where you turn the, uh, on the faucet, you could light it up and it lights up in flames <laughs> like a you know like uh, a, oh, earthquakes. Okay. Yeah. Right. earthquakes. That I mean, what's the rush? There. If it's I there, mean, it's not going anywhere. Let's make sure uh, the science and technology is there to do it right. I mean, you know, Republicans talk about how everybody's fleeing the state and going to these other states. You know how quickly members and you know people that live in New York City are going to run out of this state if they can't drink and the the waters are poisoned. Look, there, let's the, just the, wait. I mean, it's a New short term. The Shot department has a report about fracking that's being held by the governor. My my thoughts are that the health department has said that the fracking is 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 safe, and why the though? governor this, this the president governor this president's for fracking. So why and the I governor mean, won't release this report until, report until after the election. So and I don't know about gas and flames out. coming out no, your no, uh, no. your faucet, I mean, but I, I can tell you that look, I think it's safe enough. To Cuomo is certainly guilty of of playing hard to get on this issue. Yeah, I don't think there's I any agree. question about that. He promised that there yep. would be all these reports. The reports he's been holding on to them. Clearly, he's doing it for political reasons. Right. Having said that, I, I I just think you have to err on the side of caution when you're talking about something that could potentially ruin the groundwater and the drinking water for the entire New York City metropolitan area. I mean that and that. And it never goes away. It's like a radioactive leak. It's like Three Mile Island or Chernobyl. Once it's ruined, it's ruined forever. Yeah, jobs come and go. Industries come and go. Kodak, Xerox were, you know, amazing, you know, 50, 60 years ago. Now they're not. Jobs come and go. The low, you know, but this, this is a one shot. And if we screw it up, I mean, why we're do you, screwed. Why do you Listen, hate water, Richard? I love, why do you I love my water? drinking water. I love being able to turn the faucet and water comes out, not flames. <laughs> At the same time, <laughs> there's no proof that fracking is dangerous or that it's going to contaminate our water supply. I mean, we're, we're basically scaring folks for no reason. I mean, and that's what's the end. That's the, my thought. You know thought. what he did? Our counselor here, he talked until we ran out of time. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> All right. My closing statement. Yes. <laughs> thank you, thank Judge. You. Uh, Judge. Don't call me Judy. <laughs> Coming up next year, we're going to take a look at news making headlines in the Valley. Stay with us.